Hey everybody and welcome to Avamax Tying Tuesdays. My name is Brady and today we're going to tie the Butt Crack Betas created by Dwayne Redford, guide here in Colorado. This is an awesome little pattern. We're going to use the Tiemco 2487 hook for this today. And then I'm starting just some Viva 16 aught. This is an olive done color for this pattern. This matches my abdomen. I'm gonna walk on back and we're gonna go ahead and do our tailing material. So we're gonna use Coke de Leon for this. This is the light speckled color. It's kind of a lighter color. Uh, Dwayne Redford has a video out on this too. Check his video out. You can see it from the source. He says that he prefers to use a tail that matches the color of the foam that he's using. So I'm doing a white foam, so we're gonna do a nice light colored tail and just pull them off of the stem there. I try to keep my tips aligned and then we'll measure out the length of our tail. And we can go ahead and secure that in place. And we'll walk right on down this hook shank here, creating a little bit of curvature to this pattern. And we can clip out the excess there. And tie in our ribbing material. So I'm just gonna use some small UTC copper wire for that purpose. So right on the side, we'll secure that in place. And then we can walk on up, covering everything up. I'm a half hitch off. It's slipping around on me. There we go. Right about where I'm going to land that ribbing. Move that to where I want it. There we go. And we can bring that forward. Just some nice open wraps. back just a little bit to where I want that thorax to start here. We can helicopter out that wire and then we're going to tie in the foam. So this is really kind of the unique aspect of this fly, kind of a really cool design from Dwayne. Takes this razor foam, just this real thin foam, it's like 05 millimeter, something like that, and cuts a nice thin strip and then splits it right up the middle there. And what that does is gives you kind of a tie-in point here. If we lay it back, and then you can fold it over and split it, giving yourself that nice butt crack. This material is pretty brittle, so you want to be kind of soft on it when you're tying it down, especially when you're using this Vivas because it's a very sharp thread compared to UTCs and things like that, other wax threads. I'm just going to clip out that excess material, like so. And then we will prepare to tie in our next material, which is a little bit of our flat diamond braid. It's the same material that I use when I tie a top secret or the Manhattan Midge that you've seen on the channel. I know that pattern typically goes for the Glamour Madeira, but this is a good substitute. I think this is what Dwayne uses as well on this fly. So we're going to tie it in right in front of that foam in our thorax region here and just make sure we have it secured in place and we can trim out that excess material once again. And keep our foam positioned on either side here as we're working. This is what's going to help split that foam when we pull it forward as well. So now we have that kind of set, I'm going to go ahead and dub. I'm just going to do a light olive. A good springtime 
Mayfly Nymph. So nice tight dubby noodle here. So we'll go ahead and do that now, grab that foam and try and keep that sparkle wing back and out of the way. So I'm going to pull this one on this side, get it positioned. Under it there, do the same on the far side. And capture that down. Sneak in front of it a couple times. And then he can clip it off. I think he tears it off. I always tend to cut mine real close, these arrow point hair, or razor scissors from Dr. Slick make it a breeze to get nice and close. Just gotta be careful of cutting your thread like so. And then I'm gonna go ahead and give a whip finish over top. And then all we have to do is cut our wing bud to length there. go nice and tight into this foam sometimes you can cut off that little excess that you have with the thread that's all right so we'll pull our wing wing bud just our flash here right on up Go ahead and trim that out the length that you're going for, just like so.